So on tomorrow's show, I'm joined by Charlotte uh, from uh, Schroders. I'm not going to pronounce your title because, <laughs> as people will discover tomorrow, I get it wrong anyway. Uh, <laughs> um, very quickly, do you use WhatsApp? I do, very heavily. <laughs> right, okay. What was the name of the most recent group chat you were involved in? Um, it, it's a group called London Liaisons. Right. Um, which is a collection of people which will become apparent uh, in, in the interview that I met sailing around the world. And we know each other from so many variety of cities that yep. the name changes on a regular basis. We're currently on London. You did sail a quarter of the way around the world on a small boat. Yes. Um... Did you have any moment of genuine dread out there? <laughs> mm, genuine dread, uh, yes. Um, I don't think at any point I thought, I don't want to be here or I think I'm going to die. Yes. Um, I know that there were other parts of my race where I wasn't on the boat where there <laughs> people went through some horrendous things. Um, crossing the Atlantic was, uh, was fairly exciting. Going through a, a tropical storm in the Caribbean Sea was fairly exciting. Right. Um, you're putting your life in the hands of your fellow crew who you and, may or may and not. nature. Yes. But the, the massive overwhelming thing is you're this tiny little carbon fibre, you know, plasticky thing floating around on a vast ocean where you can't see land, you, can't, you don't, might not see shipping for days. Yeah, you're very much at the Earth's mercy, and you are completely irrelevant as a human being. You see, I, I ask, I ask that because of I, I get that it's an adventure. Yeah. But I think if I realised I was literally thousands of miles from land in you know very small boats in the middle of the ocean, I might have a moment of oh god. Uh, yeah. Anyway, you must have seen some fantastic stars. Yeah. Oh, the stars, the horizons, the green flash when the sun goes behind the horizon when it sets. Wow. I, yeah, incredible. Okay, so on that theme, last question, best place that you sailed into? Oh, it's got to be London. Yeah? I, I am a Londoner. It's where I was born. It's where I've grown up. So sailing up the River Thames under the Tower of London, which they raised for us, to sail into my home city, there's nothing like it. Just... Just incredible. I, and the, you know, the pomp and ceremony that London does is second to none. And just the, it was also the end of my race. Yeah. So the huge emotions that you feel with something like that and just the, the spectacle, the, it was summer, the sun was shining. It, it, fantastic. You're selling Absolutely sailing. Amazing. Yeah. <laughs> There's a lot to be said for it. Cool. Well, hopefully people listen in tomorrow. Thank you very much.